this and if I'm going to walk in this lane, it's got to be my way and it's got to be something different than what everybody else is doing. It can't be no old boring ass shit yeah. where I'm just information and it's coming off corny as fuck and I'm coming off like I'm better than everybody. I'm like, I'm already there. Like, nah, motherfucker, I'm, I'm, I'm cool, but I'm just like y'all. I still smoke. I still motherfucking listen to trap music. I still like, you know what I mean? I, 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 I to see my cousins and them like you know what i'm saying like all of that shit like it's no different i'm just like a person that's just educated himself and is just trying to put myself in the position and and ride this wave of like content creation and like you know what i mean where the future is going and i'm trying to bring my people along the way with me and show them that it's all good and it's nothing to be scared of and it's people out here that look like y'all talk like y'all dress like y'all that's doing this shit too and in addition to that like I'm not just going to be like no regular degla motherfucker. Like I'm going to entertain. I know what y'all want to see because this is the mm-hmm. shit that I wanted to see when I was looking for this shit and I couldn't yes. find it. I had to read the entire Money Master the Game fucking a thousand pages. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like I had to go to the Robert Kiyosaki seminar and sit through that shit and watch them try to get $30,000 out of me. You know what I'm saying? Like just like all of these different things that I'm trying to have y'all avoid doing and like creating a whole different lane for y'all to learn and get this shit. You know what I'm saying? And and, uh, and, and I love it. I swear, it, bro. I, I love it so much because when I was growing up, the again, the drug dealer, if the drug dealer sat me down on the side and he cracked his 40 and he broke down like, look, young blood, what you need to do is buy some of this real estate. I would have paid attention, but it, in, in our era, at least in my era, like if you were a hardworking person and you, you know, worked for the man or whatever, and they would call him the L7, they would call him a square because of it, right? You'd be like, oh, you don't want to be that dude. You want to be the charismatic guy that has the fancy cars with the gold chains and all the girls around him. But if that guy would have took some of the youth from the hood and be like, yo, I'm going to buy all y'all some ice cream. I want y'all to pay attention to this game right here. What? Probably would own half of Brooklyn by now. So I love the delivery that you're giving because I'm I've, one your 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 Instagram account, like your your followership is, is just massive. <clears throat> the way people are rocking with you, it speaks for itself. So that's why I was so excited to have you on the show because I was like, your delivery is like unmatched. I don't see nobody doing it the way you do it, bro. I don't, I don't, and I don't take that for granted either, man. Um, because it's it's been a lot of hard work to just build up my following to ten thousand followers, and I'm, you know, what I mean, really looking forward to doing more this year. That's why I've been creating and pumping out more content because I see that's what people want. And um, when you have people locking in, like, yo, man, we like this, keep on doing 